Yeah. Jump in, jump in, jump in. Them boys up to something. They just smell like. What? Nigga, you was a bitch. Ah, yo, what's good, YouTube? It's your boy, Dr. PG NGL. Praise God to get money back for another YouTube video. Banger, man. Yes, sir. Yes, man. I don't know what time it is. The doctor's in the house. And I, I, I really can't believe I'm about to talk about this right now. But, you know, I just did a long stream. And multiple people came to the stream. You know, so they shot y'all. Big salute. Uh, asking me about the infamous flinch. <laughs> from Frank Martin, Frank the Ghost Martin, you know what I'm saying? He was scared like a ghost. I'm a ghost. Ghost, 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 ghost. You know what I'm saying? Apparently, according to everybody, you know, from, 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 the, from the big and mighty tank, you know what I'm saying? Javante Tank Davis and, uh, you know, people asked me about it, so I was like, man, you know, I'll make a short, quick video about it and... <laughs> I just think, like, y'all gotta be shitting me, man. Like, y'all gotta be freaking shitting me. Like, this can't be for real. Like, come on now. Like, don't disrespect to anybody. But if you think this is really news and this is indicative of anything that's going to transpire in the ring or, or any type of uh, indication of how somebody's thinking or if they're afraid of somebody, man, these are boxers, man. These are professional pugilists, man. You know what I'm saying? These men and women that step into the ring, they do it voluntarily. And I'm not saying that nobody's scared of anybody, but you are a fool to think that they are afraid of each other on, on a large scale. Maybe a few, maybe, you know what I'm saying? Maybe a few, select few may be scared of somebody, but for the most part, man, they are fighters. That's what they're going to do is fight, man. So let's look, analyze the situation. Javante Tate Davis, you know, he's playing the role of the bully. <laughs> Of the big bad wolf, you know he's been here before. He's acclimated to 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 uh, 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 the, the, this scene, and you know what I'm saying this stage. And Frank Martin's a new guy, you know what I'm saying. Mostly a cool, reserved, uh, 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 calm and collected individual, but he's trying to match the intensity uh, of Javante Tate Davis. <laughs> Now he's failing. He's not. He's not doing that well. But I don't think that's indicative of 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 his of his, of, of, his um, of of what he's thinking or his thoughts or the fact that he's afraid of anybody. Man, I just think that's just his demeanor. You know, his natural demeanor is more calm, and and, and Tank's natural demeanor is more you know rambunctious, more uh. <laughs> More mischievous, more more troublesome, and more antagonizing. You know what I'm saying? That's what he's demonstrating right here, man. So he flinched at him. And I will tell you before before we get to it directly, there's only two correct responses to when somebody faints at you or jumps at you, right? You go either, number one, look at him like this, real stoic, like, like, I know you ain't about that life, you're not about to do nothing. Coincidentally, that's what that's what the that's what uh, Tang did when 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 Frank retaliated. Or you go and try to protect yourself and respond, and that's exactly what Frank did. He did he did the former, and Tang did the latter. You know what I'm saying? So so sorry sorry. Tang did the latter, and Frank did the former. So so what? No, I, I, dang, I'm, I'm messing up. I said it right the first time. Tank did the former and Frank did the latter. So what you don't want to do, what, what would mean that he was scared is if Tank would have jumped at him and he would have not only flinched, but he would have been like shocked with the bush baby eyes. You know what I'm saying? Call like a, like a ghost, you know, <laughs> or call like a deer in headlights. But he didn't do that. What happened? You know, Frank is a softball, right? Yeah. So what happened when when Tank flinched at him? Well, when Tank, when Tank flexed at him and jumped at him. He put up his right hand to block and he immediately retaliated with the left, which is his strong hand. That shows me that he's a fighter and he's ready. He don't know what Tank's going to do. You know, say so he's unpredictable, but he's going to protect himself at all times. He did it instantaneously. He didn't think about it. That was just his response. That's the right response. And guess what? When you get into that ring and when you do things like hit the mitts, that's what you want to do. You want to work on your reaction time. What do you want him to do? You want him to just sit there and get hit flush? You know what I'm saying? And not protect himself at all. That would be indicative of somebody that's being scared. He don't even know how to respond in the moment. I think Frank did everything that you want to see, uh, see exhibited from a fighter. You know what I'm saying? And now, on the flip side, when 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 uh, when Frank Martin flexed at him like that and 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 and, and um. Uh, jumped at Tank Davis in retaliation. What did Tank do? Tank Tank moved a little, slightly, but he mostly just looked at him like, man, I know you ain't about to do that. You ain't about that life. So those are the only two two uh, responses that are acceptable. You don't want to jump back and not do anything. You don't want to be caught like this, like real nervous, you know what I'm saying, with your eyes wide open. But you do want to respond to either one or two ways. You want to look like, bro, you ain't about to do nothing. Kind of like what Kobe Bryant did when Matt Barnes act like he was throwing the ball at him. Recipes, Kobe Bryant. Whoop, whoop. Or 
you want to be able to protect yourself and respond with a, with, a, with a punch yourself, man. So I didn't think Frank Martin did anything wrong. You know, I think this is just being hyped up. I don't think he's scared. I don't think that's what he's demonstrating, man. I think he's just, you know, he's been very respectful. And, and you know, he may be anxious and nervous, but that's not the same thing. That's not synonymous with being scared or afraid. I don't know if y'all ever played sports before, but me being an amateur boxer and the fact that I played basketball, football, and, and, and ran track and some other sports too, you know, every time I had a game or even when I'm about to spar, I felt like a sense of, you know, nervousness. Not that I was scared, but it's just like, this is the big moment. You know, it's like you feel a little anxious. It's like when you take a big, t- it doesn't even have to be in the sports realm or athletic realm. It could be an academic realm or even in the corporate world. If you have a big presentation or you have a big test, of course, naturally you're going to have some nerves, you know what I'm saying? And and, and you, you're going to be, because you're, you're, you're appreciating and acknowledging the moment. It's not because you're scared. You know what I'm saying? It's just because you know that this is a big moment. Matter of fact, if you're just going through all your moments, like it's a walk in the park or you are strolling Walmart, then to me it shows that you don't even really care about this, the, the magnitude of the situation or two, you're just so unprepared that you're like, hey man, I'm just going to wish for the best. Hopefully, hopefully uh, <laughs> God will intervene. You know what I'm saying? The divine power will intervene. You know what I'm saying? Divine intervention type stuff. But yeah, so I think this is nothing. I think this is overhyped again. People are looking too far into it. I'm not saying that, Tay's, that, 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 that Frank's going to win now. I think Tay's going to win and I'm not saying that Frank won't be won't be overwhelmed on the night of the fight by the big moments, you know, being on the big stage. That's that's all possible. But this is not indicative of him being afraid of anybody, man. These are fighters. At the end of the day, regardless of who you're going for, you got to respect both these fighters, man. They're putting, they're putting everything on the line. They're, they're about to fight each other. And we about to see on Saturday, man. I got tanked by late stoppage, but Frank is not scared, bro. Stop it, man. Stop it. Remember, with God, we can do anything without God, we're nothing. The doctor's out. Peace. I can't believe I had to talk about this crap. <laughs> Y'all crazy. From the hood to college, both worlds, they had to meet. Six degrees between us, so cold, we're about to freeze. But we're Florida boys, hot takes, we bring the heat. We're moving the culture, the engineers to the streets. <laughs>